Welcome to Harvard Spotlight on the Arts. Today we are doing a summer update for the shower. And the shower is located in the city of Hartford here and right off of North Rural. Yes. Yeah. Now, the exciting thing about having this theater and courtyard is that a lot of people from surrounding communities can come in, huge parking lot, and enjoy yes. some great talent. And you have a few things going on on stage inside the theater. Let's start with that. Yes, we do. Um, a couple of our summer usual things. We're going to start out next weekend and go on to the third weekend in July with our wonderful resident theater company, the Hartford Players, presenting Cinderella. So this will be a really fun show for families, individuals. I think people of any age can enjoy enjoy the story and enjoy the classic music of Rodgers and Hammerstein. Mm -hmm. So they will be doing that for two weekends. Right after that, the following week on Wednesday, every summer about that week, we host Kids from Wisconsin. So they'll be in just for one show this year at 7.30 p.m. and those tickets are going fast. So if you're interested in seeing Kids from Wisconsin, I would get on that right away. And then we're gonna wrap up the month inside with a group that is renting the theater to bring in a comedy show called Moms Unhinged. It is a group of all female comedians. Um, I'm a mom, I know there's a lot to laugh about when you get the ladies talking about that. Uh, so this is a new show for us. They haven't been there before. They're very excited to come in and be in our theater and we hope lots of folks come out to enjoy uh, a night of laughter in the middle of the week. Great, and so just to re actually get the dates for uh, Cinderella, uh, brought on by Hartford Players, that's gonna be this weekend, which is the 12th, 13th? Yes, the 12th, 13th, and 14th. Okay. They'll do Friday night, Saturday night, and a Sunday matinee. Okay. And then the following weekend, they will be there. Um, the following weekend, Friday night and Saturday afternoon. Okay. So, so 19th, five chances. 19th and 20th. To yep. That. Get your tickets online. I know that you offer mm -hmm. student discount and that type of thing. So yes. um, if they want to stop in at the box office, they can do that sure. Monday through Friday. Yep. Okay, great. Absolutely. And we're holding a really nice flyer um, here that outlines the courtyard series um, that has been very successful. And these are held on Thursday nights mm -hmm. here rain or shine because you have the ability sometimes to go inside. Right. If it does rain, there's a good chance we'll still have it and mm -hmm. it just move indoors. Right. And I've, I've been there and there's adequate seating in there and um, absolutely great event. And the musical acts start at six o'clock, but you mm -hmm. open the courtyard at 530 with bar service going from 530 to 930. Correct. And sometimes you have the same food truck. Sometimes you might have a, a different food truck and they can easily look online yes. at the showercenter.org look for the courtyard yep. series and it even kind of gives a description of what the band is about. Yes, a little bit description of the kind of music of the band. It'll tell you specifically the food truck because they are all booked already. Um, there is one there every week. If they repeat, it'll only be twice in a season. Um, so we try to bring something a little bit new most weeks so you can get your eats, get your drinks and enjoy some great music. Great. And so this week it'll be July 11th, Tangled mm -hmm. Lines, Alternative Rock. In Americana. Yes. Yeah. I know you have some picnic tables in that courtyard space, mm -hmm. but people are still encouraged to bring their own chairs. Oh, yes, absolutely. The picnic tables are minimal seating. Right. Um, so you are pretty much have to bring your own lawn chair if you want to be guaranteed a place to sit, but then come and set it wherever you like, towards the front, towards the back, around the edge. Okay. Um, people kind of develop their favorite spots okay. within the area each week, some of our regulars. Um, Plenty space, though, to come in and sit and get comfortable um, with friends. And it's great that it's not really a performance like in the theater. You don't have to come and sit and be quiet and listen till it's done. Right. You can come and go anytime between 6 and 9 um, and chat with your friends and enjoy a beverage while you're there. And the musical will play on. Some people choose to dance. Some people choose to just listen to the music. It's a really a very social event, and we love creating that kind of community atmosphere and community gathering. There'll be young children and older folks and everyone in between. And I know that you asked for goodwill donation mm -hmm. because this has to get supported somehow. And a lot of our community businesses are supporting this so that people can enjoy a free concert. So if we could encourage that $5 yes. goodwill, $10 goodwill offering. Um, and I just wanted to make sure 
that we did mention that these are a lot of community businesses that are offering this. Yes, absolutely. People. So many have supported this, and that has allowed us to continue um, upping the value and, and increasing the level of the bands that we're bringing in and the size of the bands and still make it free other than that voluntary donation at the door. And most of the music that they're going to be hearing is going to be a mixture of country, bluegrass, or, or rock, mm -hmm. country, rock, pop, um, and a lot of these bands have following, so. Absolutely. Um, this week's band, Tangled Lines, played for us the first time last year. They are a, a local band. Um, people really liked them and really came out to support them, so we decided to bring them back for a return this year. Okay. So, again, I'm holding this great flyer. Where could they find this if they wanted the actual piece of paper? Um, you can pick it up in the lobby at okay. the Shower Center. They are also scattered about town in right. a lot of locations um, like Swoop DeVille and a couple of the banks. Wherever library. people allow us, the library. Yep. Um, wherever people will allow us to put some out. Great. And get there. And it is, again, also on the website. Fantastic. Well, thank you for coming in, Mary. Absolutely. Love doing it and love seeing everyone at the courtyard on Thursday nights. Great. And to our viewers, as always, thank you for watching.